kind of explain to him a bunch of like innocent civilians running from this group of uh, weirdly costumed people, right? Yeah, you've never seen these people before. They could be part of the Alice gang, or they could be somebody else. They they look to you, they look decidedly exotic. And that girl with the mini that that incredibly short skirt, it's like it's like not even mid thigh, it's upper thigh. And there's a guy there that's only half dressed. You know, um Who's that? Also, Me. Korean, yeah. Um, and then there's another cool. woman. Armor, there's another woman in a very, complete. very form-fitted, extremely tight body-hugging one suit. Looks like an undergarment, but it's quite like you know red and gold, I think. Um, and um, then there's yeah, that's what you see there. It's like oh my goodness. So wait, so wait a minute. You were talking that I'm the one that looks like a whore, right? No, 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 G girl. <laughs> no, I didn't say either. Oh my like god. A whore. Well, that's not I fair see, because I know that I've got to wear a <laughs> Might be the word. So, Sonic, what are you doing? Well, as a superhero who's just ran into these obvious bad guys that just came for some kind of weird sex thing by their, like, get-ups, I guess I will, like, armor up and I will uh, flap and punch whoever's biggest. Oh, so, great. Right. Okay. Rodeo, so so... Uh oh, we got a stereotypical hero on hero fight. Yeah. We do, we do. Okay, I guys, thought... it is time thought... to roll initiative. So okay. you highlight your you, you highlight your figure. And I think it should show you then that you've got a, a chance to like roll the dice or something. What do I roll? So how like your figure? Oh, sorry, I'll bring him over for you. Cause he was over there. Here you go. Yeah, he's over here, maybe. So Ice Rider's not there. Basilica's not there. So it's these three people. Well, this so get a like this stuff, and then it should be a manual initiative button on the bottom. Hopefully, you see it. Ah, uh, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Wait. Um, Sonic's initiative. <laughs> I mean, isn't it? Need to, wait, you need to add right. your, yeah, he needs to add his agility in. Yeah. Fifteen. So you add your agility, which is a sixteen, all up, because you got a fifteen so agility. I... Now, in this game, when you you have every fifteen counts, you have another action. So but after the first action, yeah, after your first action, you've got to pay extra power points to do anything. Okay. So, so I wasn't Terry. able to say anything to this person before this battle starts. Sorry, I didn't hear that at all. It was a bit fuzzy. No, I said I wasn't able to say anything to this person before the battle starts. Nope. Nope, because we're going straight into initiative. So if you on the bottom right left there you'll see manual initiative. You can click that and that should give you your initiative number. What is that? I don't see that. You got it? No, I don't see where that is. Bottom left of the screen. On the white. Um, yeah, our, our giant size blooming things are probably covering over it. No, it's, it's all... I don't, I don't, I don't see anything. Hmm. Bottom uh, left. It's not on the bottom for me, it's in the upper left. Okay. So okay, roll, but... roll a d10. Wait, wait, I don't... Yeah, what's her what's her jelly then I'll just roll one for her. God, I don't, I don't... She's not I can see the board. Ah, there she is. There she is. Oh that's great. She doesn't zero. have anything in her sheet. There's no way I can roll to open the sheet. Give me a second. What's, what's your agility, Cherry? I don't know, because Steve has my sheet. Hang on a second. I'll go ahead and I'll put something in there for her. I'm going to have to open up. Uh, where is it? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No, it's the wrong place. 
Oh god, just to find this one thing. It's always hunting. Um, I, I, uh, we got RPG. And the battle rages on. Supers, yep. Aaron dies of old age. <laughs> just standing uh, in one spot. Yeah. Uh, do I make the first move? Do you make the first move? I think her name was Spitfire and you changed it to Cherry. Yep, that's correct. Right. You know what? Spitfire was so, already a comic. You can't use Spitfire because Spitfire was already character. So I'll save that. I'm Cherry Bomb. Cherry. He's my um, cherry pie. Right, save that. I'm Cherry Bomb. Yep, got it. <laughs> <laughs> cherry Bomb! Good old Joan Jett and the Blackhearts. That was the runaway, honey. Yep. Right, so I am <laughs> sending the character right. sheet to you very shortly. There it is. Uh, just um, a on the right now, it's coming your way. What was the initiative for? 33. Uh, yeah, as I say, her jelly is 33. Yep. Um, I, can't, I can't do. I don't. I can't do that right now. With. Oh, don't worry. I've just given you an initiative already. So. Forty one. That's her. That's forty one. I got it. Right, so I'll keep those two down. Oh here. my god! That's huge! Yep. Okay, so. That's what she said. Uh, we'll speak the same word. <laughs> <laughs> okay, on a 41. Where you go, Cherry Bomb. I'm sorry, did you I say think... roll initiative? Yeah. No, no, you don't need to. Uh, you don't you need to, you're not actually there. Oh, okay. Yeah, Good. you're in the okay. forest and I'm not looking. Okay. I'm going to go. look at this man who has just appeared and I'm going to walk off with my green bathing suit or whatever I'm wearing <laughs> yeah. and I'm going to be like, listen, we are not here to harm you. I do not know what happened right now, but we are peaceful people who, you know, <laughs> Something along those lines. No, okay. I'm no, gonna, that's I'm so gonna cool. them, Watch And I'm not, I'm not, but at the same time, because because he's not, he just landed. I'm going to walk towards him, and I'm going to use my telepathic powers, and I'm going to reach out, and I'm going to kind of like have like a little bit of flames like licking on my skin, and be all like sexy and stuff, and be all like, come on, baby, just. Oh, he's so scandalous! So scandalous! Oh no! I know. <laughs> Hello, my name is Cherry Bomb, so I'm a total slut, so just let me do what I do. Okay, so Sonic Smash, remember, you're mute. I use my telepathy. Mm -hmm. Do you want her to use your telepathy to contact yeah. your head? No, no, do you want Sonic Smash? Does she have to force her way in or not? Yeah, she'd have to force her way in. I'm going to point at the exploding head guy and way point way at the screaming crowd and running away, people. <laughs> right. Okay, so the guy doesn't say anything, but Cherry Bomb, I need you please to make a roll. I'll just find the number. Okay, so, hello. so it's rolling a d20 and d20. Roll 20 in a second. Okay, let's have a look. So you need a... You've got no... Okay. Uh, we haven't decided what's the one thing that can get through your... Um, Sonic force field, um, Sonic. My boobs. <laughs> <laughs> the power of boobs. I don't. I don't believe exactly. the power of DNA can uh, be selected no. for that particular. Um... I just, I just raised so my bikini be, a little bit yeah. higher. So, so it could be something like you know Green Lantern's um, yellow. It could be like wood. It could be um, like bone. I think he has wood. It could be. Uh -huh. it, it could oh, be yeah, a specific substance. Lightning. 
Okay, so if I have any character that's got lightning, your armor doesn't counteract it. All good. Okay, I'm going to regret that. <laughs> yep, you are. Um, that's all good. Okay, so Cherry Bomb with a plus six. Your level two versus his level three is a minus two. That's plus four. You need a what? 13 or less. 13 or less to hit him with your telepathic power, and then he gets a saving throw. So roll a d20, and on a 41, as you're talking and trying to get into his head. Roll one die 20. Yes, please. Plus what? Thir thir plus nothing. Just You just need a 13 or less. Whoops! Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. The worst okay, one well, you can I roll. Just, like, I was about to say, in the mother is this going to to that? All oh, I can say is Sherry so Bob know, has yeah. gone full Centurion. Yeah, um, just so you know, um, Zortesh, any time you are in combat and you roll a 20, because this is reversed, one is critical success, 20 is a critical failure, I then have to roll a percentage of what? to hit, and if I get under it, something really horrible has happened. Okay, so if I get a 13% or less, this telepathy <sighs> power has done something really bad. No, no, it hasn't. Lucky. No, it hasn't. It's just missed, so that was lucky. Okay, but so... Listen, can I just, like, drop my top? <laughs> no, oh, you don't keep talking. So, take off 15. Jerry, what are you when you take off 15 points? What number are you up to? What do you mean? 26. Okay. So, but since Jerry, you get to go... Well, she has the faster agility. 33. So. Yep. So, Cherry, if you want to do anything else, you can, but it's going to cost two extra power points to do it. Okay, I'm, go on I'm going to um, I'm going to reach out to his mind again and just try to like calm him with like my words and just be like, just relax. But I'm going to use my like body motion and everything and just be like, okay. we're not here to hurt you. Okay. Make a d20 roll, please. 13 or less. Oh. <laughs> right, That's okay. Zotesh, Zotesh, suddenly you feel a presence in your side your head. Um, it feels sylph-like. It feels lithe. It feels smooth and flexible yeah. and soft and sensual and it has these overtones. You, but it's really, it's not, you know it's something else. You don't know what the heck is happening. What I need you to do is give me a percentage roll versus your intelligence, which in this case is a 24% or less. So I rolled the 100? Yes, please. Don't make it. Okay, Rodio, you have, that feeling sort of starts to ease off, but you hear... The lady who just spoke to you, her voice in your head is now speaking to you the same sort of words. What are you thinking about that? What the hell? <laughs> okay, you, you hear him say, what the hell? That's okay. That's what you get, Cherry Bomb, from that. You get, uh, what the hell? So you called him by surprise or something. Centurion, what are you doing? in some building with you know my arms folded thinking to myself or even possibly saying out loud what is an Alice gang <laughs> <laughs> okay this so, even town fun radio so centurion so if you can cherry and centurion can take off to your next one um, if you're just asking the question yeah. we go to G girl all right you know what I'm going to try something different rather than smashing him. Mm -hmm. okay, well, actually, he hasn't made any effort to try to talk to us, right? No. Nope. Well, he hasn't he had a points. chance. He just points. He lands and points. That's what he does. Yeah, I pointed at the corpse when you guys said you were peaceful. <laughs> uh, you know what? Since I have communications as a background, I'm actually mm -hmm. going to attempt to sign him using... The, 
from what I remember, the sign language appro appropriate for this for this era. Okay, um, I need you to give me an intelligence percentile, please. Times right. three. What's your intelligence? Uh, my intelligence is twenty-one, so that'll be a sixty-three or less. Sixty-three. Okay. Okay, um, Sonic. Um, the the girl with the extremely short skirt suddenly starts using sign language, and you can understand her. What are you saying? This could have gone horribly wrong, by the way. <laughs> what are you What are you saying, G girl? Uh, we mean you no harm. We're strange to this location. We are st strange to here. Okay. <laughs> so Zotish, you can answer back in sign language if you want to to her. I will sign back. Why are you exploding people's heads? Okay, and Cherry Bomb, that's what you hear him say in his head. Oh, I am so sorry, man. To um, I had to go wake up my my roommate. Go ahead. Okay, so you hear him say, "Why are you blo exploding people's heads in your head when you're communicating?" He's also signing to G Girl, who's signing uh, to him. I'm gonna say like I don't think that I did that. I just was I was just talking normally and then and then something happened. <laughs> and I'm gonna bat my eyelashes <laughs> I don't think he actually exploded someone's head and then tried to do, talk to me in the same way. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm gonna point at another girl and go, It was her <laughs> I was just pointing at Jiku. Oopsie. Oh, oh, he was. <laughs> so you don't know what they said there, Jiku, but suddenly Cherry Bomb points at you. No, I didn't mean that for real. I, I meant oh. some like. I didn't mean that. I would. There's no one my... else around. Okay, because there is no one else around. Everyone else has run off. Okay, Jiku, are you doing anything else? No, I'm gonna. You know what? I'm just gonna hang tight in, just in case something goes bad. Okay. Right here, Sonic, we're on a 16. You are next, sir. <sighs> what do you want to do? You're actually able to do something now. Are you going to like. Gonna... You, you are within one inch of Cherry Bomb. He's old saying. timey. He would have just punched his chick in the face. <laughs> well, no, no, he doesn't have to, but he can still use his weakness detection plus eight to hit if he ever needs it. Oh, actually, yeah, I'll use weakness detection. Okay, Rodio, she has no weakness that you can discern, but you just need to note on your character sheet if I ever need to hit Cherry Bomb, I get a plus eight to hit her. Okay. And Cherry Bomb, um, he's not. He's masking that, so you don't even know he's got that, done that to you. Okay. Is that everything you're doing, right? Because that's an action. That's all you can do, only one action. So what happens now, Sonic, is that you go down to, you take 15 off the score point, and you go down to a 1, and that's your next action. You don't have to use it, but you can, and if you do, you've got to take off two more power points for every time you do an extra action in a combat round, Okay. Okay. So you're you're always going to get at least two actions in a combat round because you're on a fifteen. Some people like Cherry Bomb there gets like three or four because she starts off at a thirty three agility, and Basilica's up high two as well. If she gets Mine two. was actually the bomb. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So um, rightio, Cherry, you're up next. Um. Okay, I mean, so we're still trying to um, communicate to them. I mean, so what? What is happening right now? Is he kind of like a little bit more docile? Do I need to like? He's take something. He, he take something you, off or something. <laughs> I don't know what you're gonna do, but he doesn't seem to be any different in his uh, demeanor. Well, I've already made I've already made my contact with him, so. Mm -hmm. I'm going to just like kind of like push forward and go like, listen, we just walked onto this place. 
we just walked in through this portal into to whatever dimension this is that you live in and i'm just going to tell you right now that i don't know what just happened but look at me i look so fierce <laughs> She goes just gonna face palm. Okay, yeah, right. I, yeah, know, I know, I know. I know the difference. Yeah. Okay, That's I okay. can't help it that I'm dropping the bomb on him, but I can't help it. Right. He's just gonna kind That's of like cool. walk up all like sexy and stuff and just be like, yep. just calm down. I was like, we're not here to harm you. I promise you, I'm not here to harm you. Fireball! No, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> just okay. kidding. Rodeo. So, Centurion, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm still sitting there muttering to myself, you know? Alice. What kind of superhero slash villain name is Alice? Right. <laughs> okay. Well, actually, hang on. I wouldn't even know that yet. g -Gil. I'm still going to hold. Okay, we're getting right down now because you either interrupt Sonic because I'm going from a six down to a one. You can't interrupt once I get to the one. So anyone who's got a held action needs to either use it now on a two or leave it. I don't know if he really wants to take a swing, I don't care. Do we have a communication devices? I don't remember. No, you don't. Okay. Okay, what are you? Alice Cooper. On a one, what are you doing, Sonic? What are you doing, Sonic, on a one? It's up to Sonic Smash. Yep. Um, can I throw one of them with my telekinesis? Because I probably heard this guy say Ellis, and I'm like, there was the Ellis gang in my mind. Well, no, no, none of the mouse, no, apart from Cherry Bomb, no one else connects to your mind. That's yeah. the thing. Well, only cherry bomb all, all I've been doing is like leaning against the wall with my arms crossed, going, "What's an Alice game?" Yeah, yeah, I would have heard you like muttering that. I just like caught the word Alice because I always find this guy. It was of Alice. Okay, radio. So you're going to use telekinesis to have a go at him. So what's your level, please, Centurion? Uh, three. Three. Okay, so that's three versus three is a zero. Oh no, minus one. Sorry. Uh, hand to hand is a five, which takes it down to a four. You got no other. Um, I've got no other physical defenses. Yeah. Or, uh, yep. No. Okay, so four. Really and good type of defense. That would have been lovely, but. Yep. And <laughs> normally you get a plus oh, fuck. He's screwed. That's a six. He hasn't got weakness detection on Centurion yet, though. So you need to roll a six on a D20 uh, Zortish to actually be able to pick him up and hurl him somewhere. Six no, I wanted to pick up um, the chick right in front of him, me and hurl it into him. Oh, okay. Radio, um, same thing. Yes, my favorite attack. Oh, no, 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 not the same thing. <laughs> She's two, so that's a seven. You'd have to, you'd have to hit her twice as well to do a. Uh, yeah, it's a special attack, throw. so that's two sevens. Mm -hmm. Hit that person with another person. Oh my god! Mm -hmm. And one more. It's got to be a seven or less, though. <laughs> got it. Yes, you got to do two when you do. Oh my oh, god! Oh Jesus! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Radio Cherry Bomb, you feel um, all of a sudden this force that picks you up and you get thrown against Centurion. So, what? yep. Um, give me a Do second. Do I see that from thing. the tree? No. Uh, so, Cherry Bomb. A few seconds. So, that's 1d3 damage um, plus hand to hand. Which for you is 1d6. So you do a d3, a d6, and add 3 to it, please. Um, is it what? Fish? A d6 and a d3. Now, on a d, um, 1d6, 1d3. And then we've got 3 on top of that as well. What? So that's a d6 and a d3 and 3. So that's 6 points of damage. So... You get thrown into Centurion. Centurion, what's your body weight? Uh, I'm, what, four basic hits? I think I'm 190 pounds or something stupid. 
Okay, um, how much armor you got? Sorry, 220 pounds. I'm heavy. Yep. How much armor you got, matey? Me, 125 points. I haven't been hit in the combats up leading up to this point. Okay, you've just lost six points off your armor. Woof. And, um... Okay, cherry bomb. You weren't expecting this, so you have a 6% chance to be knocked unconscious. So here we go. <laughs> oh my god. Oh <laughs> my god. Like to to me. You but just got knocked so unconscious much. on the ground. Woof, he's taking you out. Oh shit. Oh, he's in trouble now. <laughs> oh my god, because whenever she wakes up, you're, you're fucking doomed. You don't know he did it though, that's the problem. <laughs> All you anyway. got was just an intense wallop in the chest and thrown into me. Wham. Like, dang. Yeah. Okay, so Cherry, right. Cherry Bomb is out cold at the feet of Centurion. The strange guy in the trench coat wearing the big goggles is standing there with, I don't know, perhaps a very intense look on his face. And we go <laughs> into the next round. Hey, hey, Before hey, hey, we hey. go to the next round. Yeah? Yeah, because yeah, I want to respond with my held action. He's getting negative 14. You can't. No. can't. You have to that jump in before him. He's on a run. I said, oh, that's what I said. Yeah. You have to jump in before him. You have to jump in before him. Turn. We're on a zero now. He got the shot in before, and we can't right, yeah. act on zero. Okay, so Cherry Bomb, I need you to roll a D100 and get... Under your endurance. Let me have a look. Get me a 12 or less on a percentage roll. Okay, wait, D100. And you need a 12 or less to wake up, basically. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> One off. One off. It's sad. It's... Oh, bummer. Okay, unfortunately, you Just don't wake move up. On. Yeah. So, you don't wake up by yourself. Others can try to wake you up if they spend an action in their turn doing so. Okay, I Thank need um, Basilica. And I yep. need Ice Rider to give me a detect hidden times two because you have been watching the area. You might see this happening. Ice oh, Rider. Well, one of the reasons I, I held back is so that I could be back up in case there was yep. some danger in the city for the group that seemed yep. to want to just plow in Ice and not Rider stop the gate. Yep. <laughs> so, what's so the, uh, Ice Rider. You can roll a percentile, or Ice Rider can tell you he's seen some sort of disturbance, and what are you well, doing, no, Ice Rider? No, me and Basilka weren't in the same spot. Oh. I, I was at the big temple, and she was up in the trees. Oh, that's right. That's right. So you're aware. So Basilica, I need you... No, you don't see any disturbance. You're waiting in the tree for some sign that you need to be called on. Okay, guys. Well, you know, after a while, I'm going to move, but yeah, not right now. <laughs> at yeah. least not for this round. Okay, so I need you guys to... So I've got to take Cherry out for the moment. Um, I need the rest of you, Jew Girl, Sonic Smash, and Cherry and Ice Rider now to roll new new initiatives. So it's a D10 plus your agility. So How long will it take me to get there, Steve? Or am I just there? Well, How far can you slide? Uh, not that far. <laughs> oh my um, God. Doesn't matter, Joe. You're unconscious, and unless we wake yeah. you up, you wouldn't be in this round anyway. Well, you just told me the wrong one. No, and everyone but you. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, <laughs> I can, I can, I can. I heard my name. It's so strange. Inches. How much? Sorry, Sid. Sixty-three. I can run faster than I can actually slide. Okay, you'll get there in sixty-three because it's about fifty-five away. Uh, no, you're in town. It's about fifteen away. All right, hold on, let me... Yep. So I'm going to... I hear a battle. Ice is coming up. So just... Yep. So, Centurion, so, you're on a 25, are you? And Sonic Smash, I need you to roll a D10, add your agility... Well, just roll your initiative again. If you can find the initiative button, roll that again. It's a big red button. Ooh. 23. Okay, I'll put that in for you. Hey, and Ice Rider. Yeah, I'm still looking at what my agility was. Okay. There you go. 19. Okay, just give me a second. I'll do a descending. Okay, Centurion, you're up next. Right, so, well, having seen that, I can only assume, given he is the only one in the area, that's considered a 
you know, super powered thing given the number of people that have run away screaming mm. that it was him. So I'm going to sort of gently let Cherry fall to the ground. Mm hmm. And then Thank I'm going you. to like run at him and do sort of the best flying knee I can straight to his head. Two shots. Nice. Yep. Go to the head. Let's go. And I can guarantee with my plus eleven, and I do not want to know what defenses he's got. <laughs> but um, those will both. At hit. the moment, he's got his. He has. Uh -huh. You haven't activated your sonic army yet, have you? Nope, because last round it was spent doing something else and then um, yeah. throwing her away. Re really important to activate your powers. <laughs> this, you have no idea how much this is going to hurt. And even though you can roll with some of it, yeah. <laughs> this is why Centurion is the group's brick. Well, kiss up. I don't care. Bang. <laughs> Okay, so um, Sonic Smash, you can roll with. Um, you've done one telekinetic pass that takes you to that much and that much. You can roll with six points of that fourteen. You take six points off your power pool and remove six of the fourteen points eight. before you. Are, yeah, so you take <laughs> yeah. eight points to your hit points. Okay, mm -hmm. so if you make that change. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> And you've got an eight percent chance of being no. unconscious in the head. Oh, to the head. Okay. <laughs> um, that's thirty two percent. Thirty two percent chance. Thirty two percent chance. Here it comes. Let's see if you get knocked unconscious. And no, you don't. But you take eight points. Your basic hits are four, so you get pushed back twenty four feet, inches. and you are on your butt. So you just got one huge ache right between the eyes. So Centurion just come up and need you right between the eyes. And he's basically made you fly back 20 feet. Won't have hit anything. It is a bit of a street, so you, you end up flat on your butt. Um, which means, by the way, Ice Rider, he is now 11 bars, inches like everyone else? to you. Sorry? Unless the other people have got HP, bar, HP bars and stuff here. Oh, I, I don't haven't put yours mine. in yet. Yeah, I haven't I don't put yours in yet. Mine. Don't worry about it. You've got your you've got your character sheet open. Yeah. Yeah. Just just put a minus eight by it or something. Or keep a record of minus eight by it so you know that you've got normally what you've got, but at the moment it's down eight. And your power score should be reading. Um, how much were you able to do? Six. So uh, it should be reading sixty-four. Okay. Yep. Right. Okay. So, Sonic Smash, what do you want to do? You're up next. I will fly out of line of sight. You'll fly out of line of sight. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to, like, poof it straight out of line Yep. So, straight up, whoosh. Okay, you guys just see this guy go, whoosh, like a rocket up into the sky. Can you all hear me? Yep. Whoosh. <laughs> Yep. Okay. <laughs> Rodeo, Hello? you close up. G girl. Yeah. Um, how, far, was, how far away is he? Um, I would say he's anywhere Miles. between one and five hundred. Max distance. So. Max distance. <laughs> five hundred and will we say five hundred and eighty-one wow, inches away? Inches. A little bit out of your range. Yeah. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna wait to see if he closes in. Okay, a hey, holding until he gets yeah. within range, huh? Yep. Oh, this is going to hurt. Okay. <laughs> Ice Rider. Uh, I will run over to the group. How far okay. away is it? So that'll be about 20 at the most, so you've got the rest you can put armor on. Uh, uh, let me just... It'll take me 20 to get there. So. Yep. And I will put... 21 points into my armor. Radio. And I will okay. say, what on earth's going on? <laughs> right, well, that puts Centurion up next anyway. So, yeah. Centurion. Uh, I'll pay my two points. Yep. I will walk back to where um, uh, the Cherry Bomb is yes. and 
Um, I will also, at the same time, mean, sorry, I'm just saying I'm walking back to you, Jerry. Um, I will also comment to Ice Rider that, um, uh, you know, that we were attacked by some crazed local. Um, and I'll <laughs> give Cherry a bit of a pat to the side of the face. Wake up. <laughs> Trying to wake up. So you use your action. Okay, so Cherry, what you now need to do is roll Hello? a d20. Hello? Roll a d20. Oh, I'm sorry. Nobody was responding to me. And my phone just yeah. like kind of like went weird all okay. of a sudden. So I, I was just trying to so make sure cool. that... So Centurion's come over and he's trying to wake you up on a 10. So you get okay, one chance at this. 20. Yeah, a D20 and you've got to get a 12. Don't tell me. You do. You're awake. <laughs> You're okay, awake. Then so, I think that I awaken and I say, Unfortunately, oh, as you wake up, it's my ugly mug that you see sort of patting you around. <laughs> it's okay. Like, I'm wake. fine. But I say, like... <laughs> Motherfucking bitch, and I'm just like my body is just like the huge okay. red mark in between his forehead at the moment. So just just remember, sick. Cherry, that your character is down six hit points because you took the full damage. So you are not on your full amount. You're down six hit points, just so you know. And you've used your power once, so you'd be down. Let me have a look to sixty six power points right now. Um, so just remember I those just numbers. Meant, I just meant by flames, I meant like that my body just is like being like licked by flames. And I'm just going to okay. stand Still up. Still using PowerPoint, like, but that's okay. That's listen, okay. Yeah. motherfucker. Okay, so that means you <laughs> that don't get crazy. to go this round, but you're conscious for next round. Okay. Okay, Sonic Smash, you're next on a eight, I believe. I'm going to armor back. I'm going to armor up. Okay, so that's um, random. So one, two, or three. I'm gonna do three D ten. Okay. You ready to roll? Oh, that sucked. <laughs> yes, well, come okay. back. Let me take a swing at that. <laughs> no. It's okay. You can you can retry it in next round. Okay, you can either leave that one. You spend three points. You can leave that one on or. On your next action, next round, you can try again for a bigger number. It's entirely up to you. But it costs you three more points. So that costs you five points all up because it costs you one point for the flight, two to do the extra action of putting your shield on, and then three for the shield itself. So you'll power up and then you go, uh uh, not working, let's try again, sort of thing. So, Jiggle, you're holding, holding, and. That's it, guys. Mm, Ice Rider, you've know. got one more action. Uh, I'm can't... putting the rest of my armor on because I didn't use all my movement. Okay. And that is the round, gentlemen and ladies. So, again, Basilica, in between turn phases, I need you to roll a percent of detect <laughs> danger. Say, the, the Scud missile that just took off into orbit sort of thing might have been <laughs> a little bit more of a... Times... Yeah, times four <laughs> detect danger. So where you go, Duck Maiden, um, Basilica? Times One, four, whatever you detect danger is. Yeah. Times four. <laughs> is it just me or is this guy crazy? He just went 1v4 against us. <laughs> mm -hmm. So um, Basilica, can you roll please? Oh, D100 again? Yes, yep. please. Yep. And times four, you'll detect danger. Oh, the bottom line is... This, bottom line is either crazy or he's Finally. comfortable. Okay, Basilica, you can enter the combat. Or super powerful. Yep. Yep. You done see the dude take off at a high speed into a sort of low orbit. <laughs> yep. Uh, okay, Rodeo, uh, I think yeah, everyone's we... there now. So everyone needs to roll their new initiatives. Awesome. Uh, everyone else roll your initiatives and put it in the turn order box, please. Okay, I'll do yours, Zortish, 2022 20, this time. Oh. 
Got it. Uh, one yeah. uh, Centurion, Basilica, and Cherry, I need you to roll your initiatives, please. Oh, oh man, that low end again. Damn, I rolled low. Mm -hmm. I, I, was, I was just about to say, yeah, he rolled a 1, I rolled a 10, and he still gets more than me, but then... Yep. No. And Cherry. Cherry, um, uh, yeah, sorry, who is this? Microphone is Yeah. Yeah, she's also muted, yeah. But there we go, there's hers. Oh, 41. And this is where he might find something really disturbing about what Cherry Bomb can do. As in fly. <laughs> and fire, but <laughs> ton of fucking fire. <laughs> okay. Rightio, Cherry Bomb, you're first on a 41. Your, mu your microphone is muted. So we can't hear you, matey. Top of the screen, there's usually a big red icon. I think she's using a phone. There yeah, we go. Got it. Yep, there. we're with you. On oh a 41, God, Cherry Bomb, what do you want to do? I don't know do? how that happened, though. That's okay. Go ahead. So I need to roll a one die what? Nothing. Nothing at the it's it's your turn. Done. What are you going to do? Are you going to chase him? Are you going to what? Please don't, not into orbit. Um, I think I that I just screamed on because I just woke up from below Centurion's feet and I was just like, motherfucker. Uh-huh. Uh, and I'm just like, and, and like <laughs> flames are just like licking my skin. I'm just going to be like, I've already been talking to him with my telepathy and I'm just going to be like, you need to either back down or I'm going to blow you the fuck up. You need to either wow. talk to us, or I'm going to destroy the fuck out of you. Actually, I think he's that ring. Because I mean, I just woke yeah. up out of a thing. You just yeah. you just sent me into a fucking coma. Yeah, he, he is I'm not called cherry bomb because I'm just like a silent person. She's like a cherry bomb. Right. So just so you so know, so I'm going to say to future, him, you know, you can either calm the fuck down or. I can annihilate you. <laughs> Just as well, he's out of range to hear that because. <laughs> I'm way up in orbit. It completely <laughs> yeah, would be really good. It's for your you information, Cherry. I can either like, this is create like, like a movie movie extreme pornographic video for you, or I can destroy you. <laughs> okay. So, Cherry. But I mean, she's is... mad. She just woke up yes. from like. At the, she just woke up out of being unconscious. I mean, of course she's going to be mad. I mean, because she was trying to, like, defuse the situation. So she's coming forward, like, you need to either calm down or things are going to get out of hand. I think things are going to get out of hand. <laughs> yeah. I like the vertigo okay. out of hand. Yeah. Okay. And as my up. hand is, like, just standing there with, like, a flame in it. Things you got to remember... He is 580-something inches away. Times that by feet. That's how far away he is from you. Uh -huh. So he won't hear you, and he's out of your mental range. So, oh. But you can say it out loud. That's fine. <laughs> At which point, the only person that's going to be scared of you Wait right a minute. Now if he, if he blasted me and he was like close by, why wouldn't I, why wouldn't yeah. I still be like in the same range? I can I can I flew the up. I flew the fuck away. Just, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I need him in the can forehead. Can I fly forward a little bit as part of my, my role? You can you'd move up. You can, you can get within a hundred and... Yeah, so you're yeah, still, like, so uh, still 500 uh, feet away from him. And the last thing I need anyone doing is forward. Yeah. I'm just at that height. Oh, I'm not catching You would that. be dead if you fell from that height. So <laughs> not, not that would be a good idea. Yeah. But if you want to, you can fly 435 inches up into the sky. He's at 581 inches. Up to you, Cherry Bomb. What do you want to do? Um, I'm going to... Uh, I at least want to fly up into, like, the range of my telepathy and just be like... And okay, say what you will... Oh, my... oh, no, you will just be outside the range this round, unfortunately. Because um, your range is 120 inches, that's 555, and he's 581 away from you. You don't have the range at the moment, but you can fly to five, 435. Oh yeah, and that's the full mu her full movement for around. She can't yep. move in another action any further. Dang. No, 
and that's it. But yeah. if you want to get close to him, you can. But you're still about a hundred and something away from him, hundred inches away, five hundred feet. No, but my telepathy has to have like a little bit longer range than that, right? Yep, one hundred and twenty. Uh, I've added them together. He's flowing five hundred and eighty-one inches. You can reach five hundred and fifty-five inches. Yeah, not. You're quite short by about one hundred and fifty feet. I'm confused. Okay, whatever. Did you want to fly up as far as you can? I want to fly as close as I can to him. Okay, I mean, Radio. like attack me. So I'm gonna fly as close as I can until he can like mentally hear me, since he's okay. you know like mute. Okay, no, that's cool. Like, you know, yep. So that's all cool. You. So you're 435. You can't quite detect him, so you know he's slightly out of range of your mental power. So that means next round, you'll have to get a little bit closer unless he moves towards you. Okay, so Ice Rider, uh, Basilica, what are you up to? Um, let's see. I mean, I, I basically saw this guy fly out of the city, out of the town. Like a rocket, straight up. Okay. What the hell did they get themselves into? <sighs> Decisions. I better see if everybody's okay. Um, scurrying down the tree and heading to this town. What's your movement rate, matey? I believe... Uh, movement. I always hard to find this stuff on these sheets. <laughs> um, hello, movement, where are you? Movement, 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 movement. I see my jumping. I don't see where is movement. Movement ground 45. Yeah. So you will be around about six inches or 30 feet away from the group when you reach your movement rate. Okay. Yep. So they can see you. You can shout and talk to them. Um, what? what you see as you're moving towards them, you can see Cherry Bomb flame on and fire up and start to head up towards the guy, but of course doesn't quite reach him. Hey, okay. what happened? And that would be my turn. Okay. What nice rider. Ready to burn his ass. Ah, shoot. Nice rider. So I'll tell um Basilica. I don't know. They got attacked for some reason. Right. Well, there's okay, nothing Maddie. I can do. He flies. Yeah. I don't know how to do that yet. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Centurion. Yeah. Um, uh, don't look here. I just learned it myself. I can fly that fast. <laughs> I, I go back to my uncaring sort of thing. I still turn to Jiggle. What the fuck's in Alice Gang? <laughs> you talking about Alice Gang? Don't know that. We were He's accused a, of possibly being part of it. By who? What is he part Sonic of? Sonic Smash, you're on a 22. What are you doing? By one of the um, you know, people in the Locals. like town. Um, oh, I'm doing my Sonic. Local. Can I fly down in front of her and like full psionic armor up? Um, this round, because this is your first action, you can either psionic armor up or you can fly. You won't oh, yeah, do both. Three more points. Oh, no. Yeah, no, you can fly. Sorry, you can fly, yeah. but you can't. Yeah, because flight is just movement now that you've activated it. You've got it for an hour. Yeah. yeah. So you're fine. You can fly yeah. wherever you want. Either you can go right to the ground. You can fly further away, further up, closer to her. But do your armor up first. So you're paying three points. Yep. Ooh, That's points. better. That's nice. That'll sustain some damage. Okay, so who are you moving to? Who are you flying to? Not a flying person. I was say I like, fly down, stop right in front of them, and then like beef up on my sonic armor, so I've got like a glowing shell around me, sort of thing. Rightio. Okay, the guy comes down, hits the floor pretty heavily. Dust flies about a bit, and as it clears, I don't, I don't hit the ground. Thing. I stop right in front of the person that's flying. Oh, sorry. Okay. Right in front of Cherry. Right here, cherry Bomb. This guy comes what? down at you like a rocket and stops right in front of you. About how far away, Sonic? Which oh, far? Right up in her face. Perfect. <laughs> how far, sorry? 
right, right up in her face. face. Like, right, okay, he stops right in your away. face. A foot away. Wait. Okay, Fury Bomb, you, can, you know you can detect his thought. You have a saved action. So wait, wait, wait a minute. So He yeah. just flew at you. He just flew straight towards me, and he just, like, stops in front of me. A mm -hmm. foot away from you, yeah. <laughs> go. yeah. Wait a minute, I was so, just unconscious a minute ago, because he just, like, blasted me into this other guy, and I was unconscious, so I'm now awake. He just, like, flows, flies really, really close to me. He's mute. Mm -hmm. He can't talk. Mm -hmm. So... Are you going to try to to send him a telepathic message? I think she's going to be like, Cherry Bob. Bible to the fan. Cherry okay. Bob. Uh, okay. Cherry, Cherry Bob. Bob. Oh, this is going to hurt. She okay, starts, Cherry Bob. She starts igniting. Her skin and everything, just flames just are going up the upper body. And she's like, listen. She goes, you either calm the fuck down or I'm going to explode on your fucking ass. <laughs> okay, so Sonic, this is not how a lady talks. <laughs> not from your culture anyway. <laughs> so, no, at least it's uh, not. Is she still reading my mind? No, she's yes, not. Yes, she's, she's not. Using not, her not yet. I she just said that she was. <laughs> I she is? She okay, Radio. Right so what like, I need to I'm... know is are you resisting Sonic? Uh, no, probably not anymore. Okay, so she gets in. Thank she's you. already made contact before. Radio. Right, so she's just said that in your head, and are you saying anything back in your head? Because you do have a chance to talk very briefly before I move on to the next person. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to think um, Alice has done worse than me, and I'm not going to let you join their gang. What? Okay, Cherry, that's interesting. He's just said to you, you the re and the rest of the group don't hear this because they're out of range. He's just thought to you, he's not going to let you join Alice's gang. What the hell does that mean to you? Uh, we'll leave it there for a second, and we'll move down to G-Girl. I just cannot wait to croquet wait. Mallet some of this Alice what? gang. <laughs> yeah. G-Girl, oh what's your thing? Oh, my God, he's going to be turned into a... Piece of bacon. <laughs> anyway, um, I don't know the conversation is going on, do I? So, Unfortunately not. Um, so I'm going to proceed with the action I was going to do before, and yeah. except I was hoping to get him on the way down, and I'll just go ahead. And help. <laughs> well, I, I was going to help him fly down. I know you were. <laughs> I'm going to, and I'm going to continue to help him with three Gs. He's okay. still miles away. He's still 400 and uh, oh, I thought he came down. inches away. No, he I came down to so Cherry Bomb. <laughs> She's yeah. 450 oh. or 430 35. something yeah, inches interested. up. We're, we're basically gawking at this in the sky, and I'm just like, I'm not catching that. Okay, you know what? <laughs> I'm going to yeah. guard against him coming back towards our space. Yep. And when he does, I am going to slam him to the ground. Okay, all good. Okay, so hold action. Radio. Yes. So, Cherry, yes. what are you doing to respond to what he's just said? Hang on, hang on. No, you shouldn't be there. 15. Um, um, we need to take two lots of 15 off, so that's 11. Mm, sorry. It should be Ice Rider next and then me. Oh, sorry, then Cherry again. The then Basilica. Me. Basilica? Um. Wait, ice Rider just... and then Cherry. Yeah, so, right. first, then Ice Rider, then Cherry, then Centurion. Ice Rider. Oh, uh, Basilica, don't you mean? Ah, uh, Basilica, sorry. Sorry, Basilica. Um, You've used up all your movement, so you can't really do a shitload. Yeah, I can't do Um, I'm just going to see where I'm at, looking up in the sky. Okay. Uh, anybody him. got any ideas? Like I say, I'm not catching that. <laughs> right. Okay, all cool. Uh, don't worry about it. When he when when he comes back down here, he's gonna feel he's gonna feel Mother Earth the hard way. Okay, Ice Rider. Anything else you're doing? I, well, I know what you're doing. Yeah. Burning on the way down too. Uh, I will use the rest of my movement to get up there, which is probably like. 
10 inches. Okay. So you are slide, I'm sliding upwards now, 10 inches. Yep. All good. Okay. Uh, let Audio. me just figure out how much that is, though. Uh, 50 feet. Oh, uh, six inches. <laughs> oh, six. Okay, that's so cool. 30 feet off the ground you are. You're sliding your way up to them slowly. Okay, Cherry, you now get to respond to whatever he's just thought at you. Okay, he said something about Alice. Yeah, he said like something that. about like, he's not going to let say, you join I'm her group. Say to him, I don't know who Alice is. Wait, hold on a second. Yeah. Okay, so you say, I don't know who Alice is. No, and you... she, I, I'm, I'm trying to think. So hold on one second. Yeah. She, um, I mean, he's very close to her. I mean, because he flew up to her. So she's yeah. going to point, you know, at him and be like, I don't know who Alice is. Right, I've already told you that we're new in this world, but you can either um, choose, like, you can either subside, and then she's just going to let, like, her flames just kind of, like, lick her body and tie and just be like, or you can burn. Okay, was, Zortish. The choice yeah. is yours. Right. Okay, Zortish, what's your response? Uh, we're gonna think Elvis is a super villain. I'm gonna point down to the ground to the general creature with the headless corpses and go, You guys are clearly super villains too. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> okay, so Chiri Ch Ch goes, What? <laughs> and we'll move on Wait, to what? I, I, no, I don't even know what yeah. you just said. I just want to know what you uh, just said. I, I said, Elvis is a super villain, and you guys are clearly super villains too. While I point down in the direction of the corpse, they got uh, the headless guy. Yeah. What do you mean by, by the way? Brain, I was about to say, isn't that like it's forming, about it? forming yeah. back slowly, just so you know. Yeah. yeah. But anyway, okay. Oh my gosh. Gosh. This, so this is going to be. Um, a bit, okay, like, I'm, I'm going to this. get ready for crap to hit the fan. So my okay. health is going to be um, some kind of either, like, I'm hoping there's going to be a building with a. a you know, cloth canopy or something like that nearby that I can quickly grab onto and attempt to use it to break something's fall. Mm -hmm. um, alternatively, uh, I'm also going to yell at Jigil to prepare for for catching. I'm already had you. Okay. Rodeo, thank you. Sonic Smash on a seven. Last person in the round to go. What are you doing? This is going to get painful. Um. So she's reacted with a what? To your assumption. I think I pull up the villain. glasses and just like stare at her. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So he sort of does a double take to you, um, Cherry Bomb, and that's where we finish that combat round. Next combat round, guys. New initiatives. Roll your d10s. Add your agilities to them. Right, well, I've got, Cherry, I've got Cherry's ready yeah. already, so I might as well just roll that for her. She's on 40. Okay, I'll put it in for her. Yep. And Centurion is D10. on... Oh, man, I love that. 25 tonight, don't I? I've already rolled it for you, Cherry. Oh, okay, go ahead. Hey. Um, oh, I'm so dumb. Basilica, like, you're Oh, my God. There. You're about... You're there. Right. Oh, it's it's still faster than all of us. Sonic, you're t what are you this time? You're 21, 21. Are you? Okay, cool. Okay, everyone's in. Mm. Okay, Cherry, what are you doing? You're up first on a 40. She, I mean, he's so closer, and then she's just like, I'm so sorry about this, but I'm about ready to explode. And she's just like, boom, I'm just, I'm just, I mean, he's already, like, knocked her unconscious, so she explodes. She just, like, full fire, just be like, boom. Okay, so when we say full fire, how many fires is, um, uh, uh, is she doing? I don't know. Whatever whatever her power is. She's just going to be, like, each, each she time is, she like, wants close to, do one to of him. Those. Yep. And she is she does just that. going to let her, like, inner fire just kind of, like, he's, okay. like, within 
range of her, and she's just going to be like, it's a cherry bomb. Okay, so you can either attack him once um, for... Just sorry, I'm just going to find it. I take him once for three power points, twice for three power, um, six power points, or three times for nine power points. If you miss one, they all miss. But it, um, I think um, the way your same. powers work, you've got a good chance of actually it working. But up to you. Okay, I'm going to do the two. Two. Okay, so you're spending six power points, which is fine because it's your first action. Your flight's still going. Um, and you're using fire attack. He's got no flame power 15. <clears throat> um, minus 2 is 13, plus your adjustment of 6 is 19. You need to roll two 19s or less to hit him with both of them. <laughs> On a what? On a, On a D20. On a D20. So, so you roll a 20, you screwed up like... anyway. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I was already yeah. say, wait, no, don't. So, no, so... Any... Oh, so my hits. God, that was so... Oh, my God, yep. that was so And the cloud. second one. Yeah. Definitely a hit. Okay, nice. roll 2d12 plus... plus plus 8 points. So 2d12 plus 8. 2d... Oh, wait, hold on. 2d12 plus, plus 8. 18. Okay, got it. Okay, there is this, guys, um, just so you know, um, Basilica, you're looking in the sky for something, you see this bright red, yellow burst of flame go... Yes! Yeah. And, you, and it, you know what that is. It's a yeah. cherry bomb. Cherry bomb has happened again. Um, luckily for um, our friend Zortes, who flame is not one of the weaknesses of his shield, you just Early get back. 16 points of that 20 obliterated in her explosion. You take no damage, but your shield is down to four points Sorry, now. Yeah. Just yeah. Okay, radio. So. Um, that puts Cherry Bomb on a 25. Next. Okay. Basilica. Yep. You can definitely see where it is. It's around about 400 and something odd inches above you. Ooh, that must have hurt. Uh, the, the, the new girl, she's gone off the wires again, guys. <laughs> uh... Hey, Iceman. Trademark. Yep. <laughs> can you come get me? <laughs> There's still like a pillar of ice you can climb up to get to me. You can, oh. yep. Oh, no, I scurry up that pillar of ice. Okay. What's your uh, crawling movement? The person you uh, want to talk to. It <laughs> is... It's better, I think, isn't it, to crawl up something for you? Uh huh. My um. Uh... Is it just the same as her normal movement? Uh, oh, it might be. Yeah. No, it is. It yeah, is she got wall crawling. So. Yeah, so, yeah wall crawling. Crawling. Okay. So okay. So you you run up pretty quickly. You can catch up to Ice Rider and jump on his back. So and I'm only like ready. six inches up. So. Yeah. <laughs> but, okay. You're with him, and you're traveling upwards. That's all cool. But I say like Jigo's probably the one who's going to get you there faster. But she's only got a range of twelve inches or something. Oh yeah. Oh, well, she can go yeah. with her. Yeah. 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 <laughs> okay. I might have to go up there anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Centurion. You're up next on a 25. What are you doing? God, I'm wondering whether or not I can pick up like a small one pound rock or something like that and throw it that <laughs> throw far. That far. <laughs> that's, well, that's no. what I'm trying to work out. I don't think you can, How maybe. far can you throw? Well, that's the thing. Is if it's a light object, I might be able to actually throw it pretty hard. Hold on. How far? Hold on. Hold on. You, need to throw, you want to throw something up there? Oh, yes. Combined attack. Here we go. Um, but he's only got a certain range before it get, regains its gravitational pull mm, and that's slow true. down. But it'll, it'll, and it'll, it'll, it'll inertia it'll helps a lot. Not for 300 inches at once. Okay, hang on. Right, one point forward. All 
right. What's your range, Jigo? My range is only 12 inches. 12, okay, so that's 12 inches of zip, and then, it, then new, its normal inertia takes place. So take 12 off your distance. 40, yep, hang on. Centurion. Right, so throwing, throwing, throwing. Assuming it's like zero, oh, or you're, you're giving it minus. Throwing rolls, the maximum yeah. distance it takes to run object if equals if is two. It's like a negative three, but I have to ten. time it. No. Oh, yeah, Sorry. About, if it's a one pound object, I can literally throw it only uh, 44 inches. Okay, so too so, far. Yeah, too no way near. Okay. Sorry, can, okay. can you read that again? Sorry? Can you read that again? How much can you Okay, throw? so I can, I've, I've got a carrying capacity of 444 pounds, right? Yep. So to throw something, it's the weight of the projectile off your carrying capacity. So if, it's a, if I found like a four pound rock, two kilo brick, I would be able to throw it um, well, that brings it down to 440, and then you divide that by 10, and that's the number of inches that you can heave that particular thing. Now, if I were to do negative Gs on that rock in a coordinated effort... Yeah, you but... Only get, you, only get 12, you only get 12 inches of extra. Regular, yeah, exactly, the, but the velocity it would achieve would be quite high. Yeah. Um, it wouldn't um, matter in the end. Yeah. And also, it would start floating away from me before I could actually launch it properly. That's why I said I had to coordinate it. <laughs> yeah. No, either way, I'm just going to get ready to catch because I think Cherry's his essentially, or well, is someone's going coming down off the rails. Yeah, someone, someone's coming down. Yeah. <laughs> Which one I have to, to sort of get ready to catch. Sort of thing. By the way, well, you know what? I'll you know, continue on my action just as a precaution. G, G Girl, you deal with gravity, right? Can you also deal with somewhat of an inertia? E.g., can you create a field that, so, like, essentially applies a, a slowing effect rather than a instantaneous kathunk. Okay, you know what? Let me see. If Let me see. How, how high is she about? 435 inches. Yeah, and Damn, I wish I had my slide down, down, with me. Yeah, I was about to say, she coming down, she coming down fast. <laughs> well, then I could go ahead and try to negate her for 12 Gs, but that's a lot of Gs to put on her. She's going to take the damage. Uh, honestly, in, out of character. She that's why, it I, damn, I, throw that's it why I say, can you create sort of an inertial field, which basically is going to like cause a lot of, rather than gravity, um, to be applied instantaneously? Can you create it so that it's about no, like, going to be I, like I, a, a featherfall sort of effect? A cushion, yeah. Yeah, a cushion. I can't slow her fall. The only thing I could do is hit her, stop her from hitting the ground. Make her not it's be as heavy, but so it, someone could catch her. Right. So you could essentially make her. Re remember, guys, the catching rules. You can jump yeah. in the air, catch somebody if you get successful and land successfully. Neither of you, I think, take damage. Oh, you'd still take damage from the velocity in mid air, though. Can no, I don't think they. I, I think they don't allow. They, 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 they allow say that? You're, oh, okay. No, you're okay to do that. I think. <laughs> I love the metaphysics. Okay, then I get ready to catch. Leaping. Well, the well that's throwing. great because I leap at three times my normal rate because of the uh, greaves, don't I? So yeah, I can uh, do a fairly yeah. decent jump. Falling, um, catching, catching. To catch a falling object requires an agility save on a d20 and a carrying capacity in excess of the weight and pounds of the falling object. If caught in the air, falling damage is completely negated. If caught at ground level, subtract the carrying capacity of the catcher divided by 50 round up from the damage total. If damage remains, it is taken by the character with less basic hits or shared if they are equal. Okay, fantastic. Um, yeah, I get ready to jump and catch. Okay. Payne, good luck with that. I'll stand by just in case she hits the ground really hard. <laughs> yeah. Well, as, 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 I'm not worried goes. about her hitting. I'm, I'm going to catch whoever falls. Well, I could throw yeah. every effect if they're both falling. It does make a I'm, difference. I'm not in the. I'm not in the. The thing of letting people get murdered or killed. That's why I always strike to yeah. knock out. <laughs> okay, so that's what you're doing, Centurion. G girl, you're up next. I'm still holding. Okay, Ice Rider. I start going up. Okay, you start traveling up. Was this my first? Yeah, this was my first turn. So that I'm means sorry. I get... So I'll use it all. I, um, I go 63 up. Um, do you pay a point in between turn phases to keep your armor going? Uh, no, I'm letting it melt a little at the moment. Okay. Already up. So how far do you go up, sorry? 
63. That's my full. Awesome. So you're 69 inches off the ground with times five, 300 something feet. You just climbed up on an ice spiral. Nah. <laughs> no. No. Yeah. Yeah, but you know. It's very impressive. Yeah. Still okay. knowing, and, and I do what I did before last round, Steve. Yep. And Sonic Smash, you'll turn on the 21. I'm going to punch a person in front oh, of hang me. On, hang on, sorry, no, sorry, sorry. It's Cherry on a 25. People haven't been taking their 15s off. Oh, yeah, sorry. Uh, that's my bad. Uh, that's okay, I've just done yours. Um, Basilica, you're on 15. Cherry's on a 25. Sorry, usually, okay. I'm, I usually do that. I, yeah, that's all cool. So, bad. Cherry, you're up first. You're up next. So, wait, wait. I just missed like so much. So no, no, you didn't. Nothing. Um, all you missed was the ground crew getting ready and Ice Rider to starting to spiral up. Okay, I just you. like, I just like burned the fuck out of him. And it didn't seem to have much effect at all. Oh, oh really? Mm. Then she's like. <laughs> Wait, I didn't do anything up. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get really close to him and just like, Are you ready to feel the burn? And she's just gonna be like, Boom! and just like explode. I don't know. Nice. I, I don't know what else to do. I mean, he's already okay. like attacking her, so she's gonna get close to him and say, well, Are you ready to feel the burn? Yeah. Be like, That's okay. It's up, she's doing what she, sure. to, what she yeah. feels she needs to. Okay, so you're using the full three attacks this round, Cherry Bomb? Yes. Okay, nine more points. Um, take ten more power points off. If any one of them fails, they all fail. So three 19s or less. Where you go on a D20. Wait. So, th wait, so three D20s? Yep. And three if, D20s. And if any of them are a 20... They've all failed, and you've probably got some disaster happening. No plus. Well, there's no need to plus anything. You just need. No, I've done all the pluses. Anything, anything other than twenties. Yeah. yeah. Ooh. Okay. Well, she's done it all uh, at once. Yeah, yeah. Oh no! no you, only, you only need just three D. The first roll is all you need. Two and a fifteen yeah. and a one, and the last one's a one. Hello. Ouch. Okay. Um, yeah, bud. So Sonic Zoom, can I please... Uh, Sonic Smash, sorry. Can you please give me an agility roll on a um, percentile, which for you is... A Under 15. 15. <laughs> Under 15. Oh, God. Can I just... She says, yeah, no. uh, Bloom. Okay, Rodeo, you'll be doing your armor will be absorbing some of this. You'll probably be rolling and you'll be falling out of the sky. <laughs> some. Okay. Rodeo, so your armor takes D how many points of armor you got? Two D twelve plus eight. The other one automatically does sixteen points of damage, full damage. Oh you be dead. <laughs> Four was what he had left on his armor. Yep. Okay, so 2d12 plus 8, please, Cherry Bomb. Yes. That's the damage you need to roll now. Please, for the love of God, roll low. <laughs> <laughs> Crispy corpse falls from the sky. Have attack. Maybe you should have, like, you should have, like, considered your role play a little bit different. Well, okay, so what, what do I need to roll? He thinks you're super villain. Two. <laughs> 2d12 plus 8. 2, okay. 2. I didn't want to attack you. I love your beard, so it's... <laughs> well, it's up to you to pull damage. You, you can pull damage if you want to. I mean... If I felt like he had some kind of remorse, I wouldn't have. Because I, okay. I wouldn't want to burn him. I mean, he's so cute. Okay. There you go. Yeah, right. Uh, Ouch. 
And then we had 16, 16 on top of that. 34. That's 44 points of damage. So four comes off your armor. Fantastic. <laughs> 40. He can I, have HP. I was about to okay. say, it wouldn't matter if he rolls with any of it or anything. Yeah, he's going to... Okay, now, if you roll with it, you could roll with about five points of it. So that takes it to five points of your power off. That takes you down to 35 oh, points of damage. Geez, How many hit points you got left? 20? Like 17. 17. Is that, so we take is that 17 after the, is off that. After the, uh, is that the 8, uh, yes. the eight that I clocked yeah, no, on? That, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's 17 after that. So he's unconscious. And he's on 18. 18, more power. 18 power points more off your power points. So you're now down to somewhere around about 37. And he's flying that and way at about 35 inches around. Yeah, okay, fine. I'm still within okay. a capable run and jump. I'm, just say, as I'm as still I... within a capable run and jump. <laughs> right. Okay. Okay, so you go boom I'm grab and him. flying away. Um, no, I'm gonna grab him. I gr I just like reach out and I'm just like okay. So no, he was already like thing. yeah. He was like in thing. my face, so I like grab him and just like hold him. Whether he like you know? already blown up without saying oh, that just, if he yeah. went. I'm him. sorry. Okay. Yeah. That's okay. Yeah. <laughs> you can chase him. You won't be able to attack. To, you won't be able to grab him until your next turn on a ten. But you can chase him if you want to. Right, so how far does he have to fall? 400 and something? No, 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 we'll see. So on a... We're now down to Sonic Smash. Sonic Smash, <laughs> this is where you get the miracle roll. Everyone gets a D100 to get your endurance or less, which is a 17% or less to wake up. You will wake up Can if you do use... with one hit point. <laughs> Can so you use a point? Percentile roll. No, you don't. Oh. Uh, you're on coat, and you're, like I say, you're flying. The, the moment back. I, the moment I saw it, the centurion was off. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Bolt. Uh, right, can, uh, hold on. can he use one of those um, inventing points? To do what? On the roll? No. Um. Uh, plot ooh, points. Plot that's points. a that, that's plot a points. good question. I didn't think of plot points. What are plot points? Okay, in the games, hang on. Um, very good pickup there, um, Sid. You're going to get experience points for that, by the way. Yes, suck it, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> okay, plot points. Uh, double your charisma modifier. Contacts of people. Example one. Mm, it costs a plot of spin. Replace the gaining new levels. It's, uh, it doubles your charisma modifier. Contacts. No, it doesn't. That one doesn't do it. But hang on a second. Uh, so I remember Minotaur did that where he. No, woke he did up something else. Out. Yeah, he did something else. He had a power that played into that. No, it doesn't. Sure? But I think what I did with the plot points was that if you can weave it into the story, it's because you're giving away such a big power thing, I'm going to let it happen. So, Sonic Smash, if you can somehow convince me that you wake up for some reason after failing that roll using your plot point, then you can, but you lose your inventing point. You only have so many inventing points. So, at the moment, you have... 7.2 inventing points. You've got tons. <laughs> so you could lose one and create a really good situation narratively about why you suddenly wake up with a hit point. Uh, can I get more of these in inventing points later, or are they like... Yep, you get, you get, yeah. you get you, you regain them every level. level. Yeah. So you get 2.4 every level you go up. But they're really important because you can use them to change your powers, you can invent things, you can solve puzzles yeah. with them that are really important I've, for the story. Well, so I've, I've been essentially using them to find extra parts of the Centurion's lost armor. Yeah. Which is why, even if you are still unconscious and I'm gapping it for you, I'm actually going to be able to make that distance. Because the last piece well, of armor probably going to get caught, but I might not. Um, so I'm like, Death spiraling down to the ground, I assume I like 
Tart like flaps around like crazy, smacks me in the face and wakes me up. Okay. Well, good. You spend a plot point. Take one inventing point off, please, off your character sheet. Um, you are back on one hit point. So you've only got one hit point, but you are awake. Okay. So you are you actually up next on the 21. You are falling. Your power ha has has turned off. You have no armor. You have no flight. You need to take an action to do something. Aww. If I turn on my flight, can I fly away in the same time? Yep. Uh, so I turn on my flight and I just book it like straight out, like <laughs> waving between the buildings and disappearing. <laughs> okay, rodeo. So guys, um, it's interesting. Sonic just suddenly just goes <laughs> and then he's off. He's gone. He he moves so fast you can't even see him. Sort of. You know what I mean? He, what? No, oh, well then I uh. Well, I just stopped he running. He only moves at 130 miles per hour. Yeah. So. What what does my plane mean? Flight. Yours is about 116 or something, isn't it? Yeah. Something you're 100 and... That's only like 15 short. Yeah, but yours is based off the flame power. He's like got pure flight. I, yeah. I'm assuming that. Whatever. Yep. yep. You have to have your flames on to actually be able to fly. Yeah, but it's like you wait until you try and go into space. He can fly. You can't. Well, <laughs> technically everybody can fly out of space. Yeah, but he can no, fly up control. there. Yeah. yeah. The problem is, is the that control. I can't breathe. Them, the bro. problem is, is that no, yeah, her power is going to turn off. <laughs> yeah. No oxygen. Yeah. Both. No oxygen. She's going to suffocate. No, oh, the you know, the do, but you're going to heat up. Well, flame is all about oxygen, so I must like hold a lot of oxygen. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. Well, that ends tonight's little interesting combat. Trying to get a new character <laughs> into the game. <laughs> I don't perfect, even know how it got to this point. Perfect I mean, comic book pitch, though, guys. Point our game instead of like being both, a villain. Both good guys think each other's bad. I like it. Well, that's how we got the Basilica in. Yeah. It was the Minotaur versus Basilica. Yeah. And well, we have to be wearing nine... Basilica because she's <laughs> 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 still sitting there like, I need to apply gravity to something. <laughs> <laughs> no, the whole thing is the, the problem is, is that right now I'm guarding against whoever ends up falling so I can stop him. The thing is, as soon as we end up switching over to the next turn, I lose my hold. You know, yeah, fuck it. I step thing off is, my the thing, is, the yeah. thing is that you weren't gonna catch you weren't gonna be able to catch him if he fell anyway with what just happened. Yeah. Okay, you think about so, it, he just went so, flying forty forty inches horizontally away from her and would have kept falling in that sort of angled direction. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. And I was like, I was like, oh god, thank god, I've got well, times three on my run. Mass per hour. Yeah. Okay, so folks, this it's is where party. we leave it. You guys <laughs> are sort of. Um, so, Cherry, are you flying down to your teammates? I mean, if I blast him out of the sky and he's like, I, I don't know, I'm gonna. Like well, you watched him fall, and thing. you you were about to chase after him to catch him, and then all of a sudden he fell, and then all of a sudden he just went, woof, flew away. Okay. So he was conscious. Uh, I just and kind of like, and I just kind of like lay on the ground with my team, and then just like, like fix my hair, and it's like, okay, okay. What on earth happened? <laughs> okay. Um, and when you say no. that, from behind, and then whenever he you, says, "What on earth happened?" I'm just gonna say, like, nothing. Well, no, no, the, you can't say anything. Honor. No, no, because you're being interrupted by someone. At that moment, you hear voices behind you say, "Yes, that's what we'd like to know." You turn around, and and sorry, guys, I need to get back to my drive to throw the picture at you. So, oh no, a picture is coming. Oh. A picture is coming, yes. Rather oh, nice. a picture is coming. Her powers are the throw pictures at people. Okay, where the hell is the picture? <laughs> Down the bottom somewhere. Sorry, it's taking a while to find the bloody thing. And I blow them a kiss and it's actually a, a cherry bomb. <laughs> <laughs> As long as you're not, you're not going to machine gun Nelly someone again, that one was horrific. No, it's just one. It's just like, 
Cherry Bob. Oh, where are they? Oh, my uh, God. There we go. There we go. Oh, you bugger, you moved. <laughs> there. Right. Now, if I go down again. The only thing I see are tanks at the bottom. Tanks? I don't see those. Tanks. I think that were from another game. Oh, no. No, yes, yes. That was from the um, nuclear reactor the game. Tanks. I, think. I don't see well, any tanks. tanks. No, they were from the Khashoggi game. No, because uh, I'm, a, I'm logged in as GM. Yeah. Well, you can see all yeah. the bits that are hidden. And he sees the darkness, the black. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. I'm getting to them. I'm getting to them. Sorry, sorry. It's just taking the darkness really within us all. Ugh. The hell? You're in the Here room. What do you do? I attack the darkness. I attack the darkness. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. as as it's, it's loading in. It's loading in. I am Galstaff. Okay. So you sure turn I'm around. Right. But you have to cast <laughs> magic missile. <laughs> Always the first uh, to die. Oh, that song was so great. This is what you Ooh. see, guys. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. okay. Um, oh, there we go. I got okay. the dual mouse. Um, the lizard. I'm. The lizard is. Jabberwocky. The, the li lizard oh, or wizard. Oh, yeah, that's a Jabberwocky. The lizard wizard. You have Alice in the middle, who is starting to change size. Mad Hatter beside her, say, a robot-looking Queen of Hearts. I don't even. Mouse, I don't see the March it. Hare and the Hare, and that's where oh, we'll finish. Oh, it's the March Hare, not the Dormouse. Looks like the Dormouse. No, the, the Dormouse is the mouse. Is and the, 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 uh, the no, that's the rabbit. Is this one? Yeah. Oh yeah, I was about to say. March Hare is this guy. I'm somewhat annoyed. Ooh, not one of them finish. seems to be swinging a croquet mallet. Oh, wait for it. What? I have a, I have a picture I of it. I do not see ago. anybody with a croquet mallet. Okay, you remember what a croquet mallet looks like in Alice in Wonderland? Flamingos. Uh, it's a flamingo. Yeah, I was about to say. Wait, wait a second. Now, wait, wait a second. I am looking forward to stealing someone's croquet mallet. <laughs> oh, we're Listen, hoping somebody ready? will have a croquet mallet. Gotcha. Can, can you just imagine the centurion walking around with an Alice in Wonderland croquet mallet? No. Uh-huh. No. Oh. Okay, so... Boring. How many, how many flamingos?